Hi, I'm Josh from EasyClean. Today we're going to do a quick walkthrough of our hot water 4000 PSI 120 volt burner, a diesel fired. The machine is fully, fully welded. Uh, it's a 12 gauge roll cage. Uh, the whole idea of the roll cage here is to be uh, user friendly, but again for protection. So we're transporting a tie down spot, easy to move around. Uh, but again, it's added protection there, so if the machine bumps around, it uh, doesn't damage your major components, engine pumps, heating coil, etc. Another nice key feature about our machines, our studs are welded into place up underneath the frame. So if you ever need to remove the engine for any reason, uh, you don't have to get underneath and try to get a wrench on. Those are welded in place, so again, just the ease of uh, maintenance on that is what we thought about there. Uh, the machine's fully powder coated. Uh, again, a nice durable finish. Uh, so again, it can take the beating and the elements. Nice little key features on the back here. Our handle makes it good for steering. Uh, if you don't get the optional hose reel, also makes a nice spot to store your hose. We also have our lifting bar here. So for ma maintenance on your machine or if lifting in the back of your truck, uh, you can put your strap on here and lift it up. Again, if you're working on your pump or engine, you can lift it up on your workbench and, and work on it. On the front of this machine, we have our spray nozzles all here, color coordinated uh, to tell you the degrees just for uh, convenience. This machine features uh, 13 inch pneumatic tires. Uh, it has a 3 quarter inch solve axle that are threaded. You just take your nut off and pull your wheel off if you ever have to change them for any reason. Again, just ease and convenience. It's solid. It's a solid axle. It's not cheap. Again, you'll see a lot of the competitors' machines out in the marketplace that uh, cheap out on the axle. This has a 10 gallon fuel tank, so it gives you four to six hours of uh, constant uh, supply of hot water. So you fill that full of your diesel fuel, your gas, start your engine, set your thermostat to desired, desired temperature, and, uh, and you'll achieve that. Uh, this machine here features our 14 horsepower uh, Kohler engine, uh, also available with the Honda. Uh, we have electric start, recoil start on this as well. Nice little key feature that we put on uh, all our machines, uh, a quick drain for the engine oil. Uh, instead of having to go back here to the stub of your engine and having to run it all over, we extend it out away from the frame uh, so you can put a pail there and uh, catch your waste oil. On our air breather on our Kohler machines here, we have a summer mode and a winter mode. Uh, there's a snowflake here. Um, tells you uh, it's winter time, obviously. Uh, so what that does, you can adjust your air breather uh, in the summer mode. You turn your air breather out so it's pulling uh, cold air into the engine. In the winter time, uh, the inlet intake is near the exhaust, so you're pulling warmer air in just for uh, performance of your engine. This is where your, your choke is located and your, your gas control for on and off. This is where you'll be shutting your machine off, either at your key switch, or you can adjust it right here on the off setting. It's recommended to, uh, when transporting your, uh, your piece of equipment in the back of a truck uh, is to always have your fuel in the off setting. This unit also features our general pump. It's uh, three and a half gallons per minute, 4,000 PSI. The unit comes standard with a low pressure soap injector. Uh, so one of the five spray nozzles you get is a soap nozzle. You put that at the end of your wand, you drop this into a pail of your chemical degreaser soap. Uh, that'll pull your chemical uh, through your pump and uh, at low pressure. Uh, that's standard on all our machines. We also have our unloader here so you can adjust your pressure. So if you're washing your car or house, you don't need the 4,000 PSI, you can adjust your pressure down. The unit uh, burner runs off of 110 volt. Uh, so for the burner to operate as a hot water unit, you do need to plug this into 120 volt. Um, also on this unit, we do have a spot for a battery to be put. Uh, the battery is for your electric start. Uh, if you use this unit without a battery, you will have to use just your recoil start. Over here on the side of the machine, this is where our thermostat's located. Again, this is where you adjust your temperature. Uh, you know, if you want to run at 170, 180 uh, Fahrenheit, you can, or turn it down, or run it as a cold water pressure washer, whatever you like. So this is our heating coil, Schedule 80 pipe. Uh, this is wrapped with a ceramic blanket. On the outside, we have a stainless steel wrap. Uh, this is just one of our many models, and uh, thank you for watching our video, and feel free to give us a call today at 1-800-315-5533. Ask for Josh, be more than happy to help you.